A friend of mine is married to a very shy woman, one who has much difficulty talking about anything related to and her husband was her first and only partner, though she knew he had had some experience prior to their wedding night. It was no surprise then that it took her five years to summon the courage to finally ask him how many women he'd slept with. You must be kidding. I can't answer that without getting in trouble, he protested. No, honey, it's all right. I promise I won't be upset. I'd really like to know, replied his wife. Well, okay, if you're sure. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, then there's you, eleven, twelve, thirteen. He's due to be released from the hospital sometime next week. A man boards a plane and, to his surprise, finds the Pope in the seat next to him. Shortly after takeoff, the Pope opens the newspaper and starts working on the crossword puzzle. Almost immediately, the Pope turns to the man and says, Excuse me, do you know a four-letter word that ends in unt and refers to a woman? Just one word leaped to mind, an extremely vulgar one. The man thinks to himself, I can't suggest that word to the Pope. There must be another word. Then it hits him. He turns to the Pope and says, I think the word you're looking for is ant. Of course, proclaims the Pope. I don't suppose you have an eraser? <laughs> a Chinese doctor can't find a job in a hospital in America, so he opens a clinic and puts a sign outside that reads, Get treatment for $20. If not cured, get back $100. An American lawyer thinks this is a great opportunity to earn $100 and go to the clinic. Lawyer, I have lost my sense of taste. Chinese, nurse, bring medicine from box number 14 and put three drops in the patient's mouth. Lawyer, ugh, this is kerosene. Chinese, congratulations. Your sense of taste is restored. Give me my $20. The annoyed lawyer goes back after a few days to try to recover his money. Lawyer, I have lost my memory. I can't remember anything. Chinese, nurse, bring medicine from box number 14 and put three drops in his mouth. Lawyer annoyed, this is kerosene. You gave this to me last time to restore my taste. Chinese, congrats. You have your memory back. Give me $20. The fuming lawyer pays him, then comes back a week later determined to get back $100. Lawyer, my eyesight has become very weak. I cannot see at all. Chinese, well, I don't have any medicine for that, so take this $100. Lawyer, staring at the note. But this is $20, not $100. Chinese, congratulations. Your eyesight is restored. Give me $20. A man and his wife were having some problems at home and were giving each other the silent treatment. The next week, the man realized that he would need his wife to wake him at 5 a.m. for an early morning business flight to Chicago. Not wanting to be the first to break the silence, he finally wrote on a piece of paper. Please wake me at 5 a.m. The next morning, the man woke up, only to discover it was 9 a.m. and that he had missed his flight. Furious, he was about to go and see why his wife hadn't woken him when he noticed a piece of paper by the bed. It said, It is 5 a.m., wake up. 